I don't know. I was kind of thinking, you know, what hasn't been been done because you know you're getting a lot of these strange sort of uh, concept games going on. But uh, and and for some reason, the Magic School Bus came to mind, and uh, there was a, a whole thing of that where they went inside someone's body, and so. So I was kind of thinking like some sort of art game or first person shooter set inside the human body would Interspace. be kind of yeah it would it, be kind of crazy. I, so play, I don't know I, if it's been done yet or not, but I actually I would I would play an inter- inner space game. Um, Dennis Quaid would Dennis Quaid be part of it? Would Martin Short be part of it? Martin Short's not doing shit right now. Quaid a little bit busy, but Martin Short could come in on that. I think uh, you could do an inside the body game. I'd yeah. As long as Dennis Quaid is going inside the body of Randy Quaid. <laughs> Whoa, dude! Dirt. Whoa, out of context. That is awful. <laughs> well, it was for a specific reason because it actually you go inside his body at that pivotal scene in Independence Day because you've got to get his adrenaline <laughs> high enough for him to bring down the spaceship. Maybe D- Independence Day Two should be from Dennis Quaid's perspective as he's inside Randy Quaid's character, who during the game, I mean, or during the movie, Randy Quaid's character is like a drunk. Heck Everyone's yeah. like being real <laughs> with them, you know what I mean? That could be good, and you're dodging alcohol and and whatever <laughs> fumes come from a, a bug plane. Um, and <laughs> because think about it, I mean, if you're inside someone's body and you're so like everything's like obviously to a much major scale, you have no idea what you're looking at, you know. Yeah. So, so think about that. I think it would be kind of. It's not, that's why I kind of you know pitched it as <gasps> like an Actually, art this- game. But here's actually, let me take this to a next level, okay? So what if the aliens were working with the Terminators from Skynet from the Terminator movies? They sent miniature Terminators back in time (gasps) into Randy Quaid's body to prevent him, because they knew he's going to win, to prevent him from doing it. And as Dennis Quaid and a team of professionals, you go inside Randy Quaid's body to prevent the Terminators that came from the future from preventing the apocalypse that's about to happen. Checkmate. 